okay? Just so y'all can see. Okay, 200 pounds, y'all. Day seven, look at this. One more time, y'all. What's good, y'all? It's your girl, Tingaling. Very excited because I haven't fasted in a while. So this is my first time fasting in maybe five months. And my body is like, look, boo, I don't understand what you're doing. You know that you need to fast. So we're about to weigh. Y'all, I have gained maybe 15 pounds. Um, The craziest thing ever is I saw the weight come. I kind of fell in love with the weight. And I'm like, bruh, I'm gonna have to keep this weight because I just felt like I really like the way it look. I look softer, da, 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 da. But at the same time um i don't like growing out of my clothes i don't like my clothing fitting tight and um i would just say now i've had my fun with my weight and um just eating and all that stuff like typically uh when i fast um of course you lose weight i'm not fasting to lose weight but i'm fasting to detox overall but that's just kind of what comes with it it's a bug and i hate them bugs okay anyways y'all but yeah that comes with it but even with gaining weight that's like less detoxing depending on you want to gain healthy weight you don't want to gain bad weight do that make sense so it's just like i know i've been gaining bad weight because i haven't been caring about what i've been eating and i've been enjoying myself and birthdays and this and that but i am through with it so even if i do gain in the future i want it to be healthy weight but i would much rather be athletic and healthy um bigger instead of just fat or trans fat or you know good health is messed up type of uh bigger so yeah i guess when i put some clothes on i'll show you guys my body but i haven't eaten anything today yet um we're about the weigh up real quick and then we're gonna move on to the next part y'all when you weigh you should weigh yourself with no clothes no nothing okay 200 pounds y'all so y'all i'm 200 pounds um that's pretty cool for me my regular weight is around like 180 185 so like i said i gained like a, a few pounds and i really do like the way it look i'm gonna show y'all my body later when i put my clothes on but yes so first thing I like to do, first thing I like to do when I'm fasting is drink a bottle of water in the morning and that kind of holds me over um, for the majority of the day and then I'll make my smoothie that I'm going to sip on throughout the day. Um, I have different drinks in here that I, I like to drink throughout like this Synergy. It's raw, stuff that's gonna detox you and cleanse you out, y'all. That belly be flat as hell when you done. So I'm about to go ahead and drink my bottle of water, y'all. I'm going to bathe and then I'm going to come back and show y'all my body with my clothes on so you can see kind of like how I'm proportioned out and all that good stuff. Okay y'all, so this is my body. I'm gonna zoom in, okay? You can see I got a little, little stomach there. Okay, just so y'all can see. Back, okay? And we are aiming for a minimum 10 days but I'm going for 14. But when I start taking on stream is working stuff like that, y'all, sometimes I'm not able to fast because your body, your body tends to, I'm gonna say be a little bit weaker, um, just depending on what you eat and, and things like that when you're fasting. So yeah, y'all, I drank my bottle of water. It's on and pop it. Make sure you weigh yourself before you drink your water, okay, y'all? You wanna weigh yourself on empty if you can, and that's how you're gonna see the actual weight. I mean, your actual weight and stuff like that. But yeah, y'all, so about to get to this first movie of the other day. Smoothie down. Y'all like this drink because it's raw. Kombucha, y'all. It has great, great attributes. The drink is good. It helps with energy and things like that. I really love them. And it's all organic. So that's why I drink these from time to time. But I go more for the natural juices or I go for uh, pure almond milk. Um, so in that smoothie, I did mixed berries and um, mixed berries and avocado. <laughs> So it's not, avocado is not something you typically put in your smoothies, but I like to put as much greenery in them as I can. So I'll do avocado, broccoli, green beans, stuff like that. I'll mix those in my smoothies. And y'all, I do have a smoothie um, recipe book in which I use every time I'm fasting that I will leave in the description for y'all. It's a it's a smoothie uh, recipe ebook. So y'all be ready for that. It's got more than um, 30 recipes, 30 different types of smoothies inside of the book. So yeah. Y'all, let's get this day started. I don't know if I'm gonna be doing a throughout the day thing or whatnot, 
Maybe if it's something special that comes up, but overall, I might just put this all in one video. That way, it's just like all put together, all of the days back to back. So if I'm feeling a certain way, whatever, I'll let you guys know. So I love you guys so much, I'll talk to you soon. I meant to tell y'all that one thing I do uh, for the like the first three or four days, I'll do organic um, raw nuts, I'll do almonds, just to get the, the chewing sensation gone. Yeah, I'll do that for like three to four days at max. And then I'll also eat whatever I would put inside of my smoothies. So, for the first few, few days, I'll do raw broccoli, um, raw carrots, I'll do um, bananas, you know, banana chips, stuff like that for the first few days to kind of wing myself off. Because I'm an eater, like I, I'm a foodie and I like to chew. So yeah, I'm not all about, um, it's not the food for me, it's just the habit of chewing and things like that that make me comfortable. So yeah, I just wanted to drop that in there for y'all. We still on day one, weighing up 200 pounds, baby. And y'all gonna see this shit fall off, the weight gonna fall off, even though that's not my goal. Y'all gonna see how flat my stomach is, my belly is from detoxing all of that, that all that, you know, toxin, the grease and all that stuff. So, I'll be back y'all. So y'all, like I was saying, for the first few days, I'll snack on cashews or something like that. So right now, I'm eating a couple of cashews. And that tastes so good. Y'all, it is 7.13 p.m. Haven't eaten anything but my one smoothie. And then I had um, just a handful of cashews. And then I had some grapes. And that's it. So like I said, for the first day, or like the first three days, while I'm fasting, I'll eat a couple of things, you know, to wing me off from chewing, which is like the organic um, cashews, almonds, uh, things like that. And then I'll do, um, I'll snack on like grapes. Anything that I will put inside of the actual smoothie, I will actually munch on. So yeah, that's what I do y'all. And it helps me kind of wing off the chewing and the eating thing. Um, but yeah y'all, so it's nighttime now. I'm about to get ready to wash my hair, take my butt to bed, get up. Oh yeah, when you're fasting, you be wanting to go to bed faster. Cause guess what, you can't eat all day. So I be trying to end my nights as soon as possible and wake up do something to energize myself and keep going. But yeah, I try to get as much sleep as I can so that I can go without worrying about eating sometimes. But yeah, if you're busy, that's also cool Um, because you stand tired of doing something. But yeah, I'm really a foodie and I love to eat. So I be trying to go to sleep early to wake up and get the, the days out the way, okay? So I love y'all so much and yeah. I'm gonna talk to y'all in a minute. Good morning, y'all. We are about to come in and weigh the second day um this is day two of the fast y'all i did wind up like i said uh snacking on cashews last night because i just felt the need to so i reasonably did that um but like i said for the first three days that's what i always do that's what i've always done um so whatever i would put inside the smoothie um whatever i would put inside the smoothie i would eat raw um, and then on top of that, I'll just eat almonds, nuts, stuff like that for the first few days, just to wing myself off. Uh, fruit chips, like banana chips, stuff like that. I just try to get the stuff that don't have a lot of uh, sugar and things like that. So yeah, the organic stuff, y'all. We by the way, yesterday we was 200 and something, so we about to see what we are today. You see that, 198. Point eight. So y'all seen for yourself so far, we lost about two pounds. Um, so I'm about to get to my first smoothie. My stomach is extremely flat. I see my abs coming back in already. So I see that stuff dropping off. That's crazy how it happened so fast. Um, but other than that, y'all gonna see the skin. Like my skin is pretty much clearer than it's ever been in life. But y'all gonna see this shit super baby booty smooth. Like skin clears up, all that clears up. So now I'm about to drink my bottle of water. And y'all throughout the day, whenever you get thirsty, I mean, whenever you get hungry, drink you a bottle of water, honey. And that's how I get through it. So yeah, I'm about to start this day up. I'm about to get my first smoothie roll in for day two. And I'll be back, y'all. I don't want you to. I don't want you to take it. 
she was telling her they always consist of me hanging out with this nigga at the house. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. This is day three, and I'm just going through the house, opening all the windows. My face looks so oily. I am about to fix this. I fell asleep with my makeup on, y'all. But um, day three it is, y'all. Let's do this weighing. Let's do this weighing. I do have clothes on, though, so I hope that it's not a fake. Like I said, it's very imperative that you do not have clothes on so that you don't mess up your weighing process. And um, you want to get your actual weight. So when you have clothes on, you have extra weight on you. So you need to strip down there to see exactly what your weight is. So here, I'm just going to go ahead and take this sweater and stuff off, and then we're about to weigh right now. Oh, before before I do that, though, y'all, I will let y'all know I had two smoothies yesterday, and um, I had some nuts, some grapes. Um, and yeah, that was about it. So so I did make an, another smoothie last late last night when I woke up because I was super hungry and that's what I drunk I had drank um and then of course water throughout the day so yeah right back guys Okay, y'all, so that's 198.8, I believe. It was at 198.9 or something like that. I don't remember, y'all, but anywho, um, y'all see that the weighing is damn near the same. Um, some days it happens like that, and then some days you will lose an ample amount of pounds at once. So I'm not um, discouraged or nothing like that. Uh, like I said, I don't aim for weight loss. I really just aim for healthy um, detox. So, but I do like to weigh myself just to see what's going on, but I can already see some weight shed it off of me already. And people even said it in person and it's only like three pounds or four pounds. So, so far in three days, y'all, we lost about three pounds. Sorry, y'all, my camera died. But yeah, as I was saying, when I first started, uh, we started off at like 201. So yeah, we did three pounds in three days pretty much um yeah let's stay throughout this day i will be drinking my first smoothie soon um and yeah y'all what i like to do instead of coffee when i'm fasting is drink tea um that's kind of my substitute but i did have a coffee yesterday because man i needed that energy i ain't gonna lie i needed that energy <laughs> um so today i'll do tea and things like that so yeah y'all stick in there um i'll be back when, it's, when i'm about to make this first smoothie and then i'll see you guys in a second day three day three so y'all i did eat some watermelon okay i did eat some watermelon y'all not only did i eat some watermelon i've been drinking my what's up day three y'all i'm about to get ready um to go to bed today i didn't drink that many smoothies you know what i don't think i had a smoothie at all i had my tea um i drank some water and then i had watermelon and that's it today so um i'm definitely gonna go in in the morning i'm gonna go to bed wake up in the morning um and drink me a really good um a really good smoothie to keep it going keep my nutrients up and stuff like that so um, I'm probably gonna have it with some oat meal inside. You feel me? Probably throw some broccoli up in there or some green beans or whatnot up in my smoothie to make sure that smoothie got some good nutrients in it or whatever. So, y'all, it is actually, um, it is 9.22, 9.22. So I'm about to get ready. I just actually been focusing on doing a lot of other stuff and that kind of helps me not want to eat. <laughs> you feel me? So yeah, that's what I've been doing y'all. And I actually have a workout session tomorrow. So this is going to be crazy. I'll hit y'all in the morning when I'm about to work out and eat and all that good stuff. Well, and drink. <laughs> But I don't want to make this video extremely long, but I do want to show y'all along the process of this fast. So, because I am going to put all the days together compiled in one. So, yeah, y'all, I love y'all so much, and I will talk to y'all in the morning. Good morning, y'all. It's day four, and um, I feel good. Like, I didn't have to. Um, I just feel amazing. Um, last night, well, yesterday I told y'all I ate, like, uh, fruit. That's what I did. I ate watermelon, because sometimes... What I found out about myself is I get bored with food fast. So I have to switch it up and do different stuff. So that's why I wound up eating watermelon yesterday, but that's all I ate. Drunk all my water and then I ate a few nuts, but that's about it. Um, yeah, I'm about to get into my first smoothie today. This one is going to be an all fresh fruit smoothie instead of a um, frozen fruit smoothie. So 
let's weigh up real quick, y'all. See what the hell that's talking about. And then we're going to hop into our first movie of the day. So y'all see that? 197.6. And that's it, y'all. So I did lose more weight. As y'all see, my skin is clearing up like a wildfire super duper fast. By the time I'm done with this fast, I won't have any acne on my face at all. Which is another reason why I love doing this detox. Oh, I feel good. I'm excited, y'all, about the day. Y'all, my almond milk, that's vanilla unsweet almond milk. I try to stay away from sugar as much as I can, but sometimes it don't work out like that, but, um, cause fruit is naturally sweet. So that's why I try to make sure I get my vegetables in too. So today is day four, but I'm still going to go pick up some raw broccoli so that I can incorporate raw broccoli into my smoothies. Um, and what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna take it to uh, halfway with the fruit and raw veggies and then I'll take it the rest of the way liquid. That's how I'm going to do this fast. So I definitely encourage y'all to manipulate it to the what's gonna be best for you, of course, but just make sure you're still staying in the range of the fast because you don't want to get too out of hand with your rules now. Because what's the point of doing it if you're not gonna do it right? It's not gonna help me reach the goal that I'm trying to achieve. So by me saying, okay, instead of three days of the fruit, um, and raw veggies. I'm saying I'm gonna do maybe five, which is still not a difference, really, because there is a difference because you're actually eating and chewing, but the difference is it's not a difference because it's still the same thing that I will put inside of my smoothie. Do you get what I'm saying? So it's just a different way of consumption. I'm not changing the actual fast itself. It's just the consumption. So. That's what I'm gonna do this time, y'all. Feel free to do it with me if you want. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna keep showing y'all how this is working. Um, I done lost four pounds so far. Y'all can see my skin is cleared up like crazy. It's still going, it's getting better. And we're gonna keep working because today I'm working out with this fast. Okay, let's get it. So y'all, I didn't set up outside. It's no games here. Y'all, it's day five and it's going down. Your girl has been holding in there doing her thing when it comes to this fasting. I feel amazing. As y'all can say, my, see, my neck then shrunk, my face then shrunk, okay? I know y'all see a difference from the first video. I know y'all see, the, and today I'm gonna show y'all my body too. Again, so y'all can see like the transition of my body. But last night, y'all, I ate a um, banana peanut butter smoothie. It was so good. Um, it was very delicious and that smoothie really held me over very well So I will be adding a new recipe for the banana peanut butter smoothie because it was so good Um, so yeah, let's get into this weight, but I'm looking at myself y'all and my head is so small I'm just looking at the neckage like the neck <laughs> Baby girl looking good Let's do this weigh in so I can show you guys my body on day five and you can see what the hell is going on, okay? Okay, y'all, we at 197.6. So yeah, y'all, we did lose something. Um, but once again, like I said, when it comes to this weight loss, um, when it comes to the weight loss part of this, the goal is not to just lose weight. As you can see in my face overall, I have lost fat. I have lost this and that, and yesterday I actually did work out um, as well. So you could, I'm just saying, if you like one of the people working out while you're fasting, you could be gaining weight and losing fat at the same time. You just never know. So don't focus so much on the weight 
um because i can physically see what's happening do you get what i'm saying i see the transition um but also that is not the focus the focus is to get the skin cleared is to detox feel good have more energy you know what i'm saying that's your focus and your drive for this fast now if your drive is specifically weight loss that means you have to lose the weight be extremely strict i would even consider just doing all liquids honestly um and then making sure you keep that weight off once you're done because one thing about fasting you lose the weight but you have to keep up the new regimen that you have started um sometimes you may gain a couple pounds back which is okay if you lost 20 pounds you gain four pounds back eating that's actually really good but you have people who lose the weight and then come back and start binge eating um right after the fast is done and it's like you gain all the weight back um so definitely picking up after the fast some type of workout regimen some type of eating regimen in, that way you can keep your weight off and continue losing you know and getting to your goal or whatever like that I know y'all see a difference yo look at that look at that waist crazy bruh stop playing crazy five days and y'all seen what it look like. That's five days, extremely flat, baby. If you comment you don't see it, then you lying. Cause I see it, come on now. All of this up in here, flat, just flesh, five days. So now y'all, I'm about to do my first smoothie of the day. And I went and brought some raw broccoli. So I think I'm going to do my strawberry fusion. It's uh, strawberries and broccoli. It's so good though, y'all. It's so good though, y'all. So yeah, that's what the hell I'm gonna eat today. Um, that's what I'm gonna drink today. And yeah, like I said, last night, I had had that other smoothie. It was so good and it actually held me over that um, banana peanut butter. I'm adding that to the recipe book. It's so good. And you have to make sure you have raw, organic natural peanut butter for the recipe okay so i'll be back in a minute y'all and i'm gonna uh, catch up with y'all a little bit later i'm not gonna show making a smoothie today but i'm about to drink my smoothie and then if i have any other things i want to tell y'all and i'm gonna show y'all okay yeah we are having a buns and body boot camp live right now for everyone to see i prepared one of my smoothies y'all this is the green goblin smoothie of <laughs> amazingness okay green goblin smoothie it has pears apples broccoli and spinach inside but look at it that just looks so delicious y'all okay and that's what we're doing we live we're gonna pour it over i like to use my little cup that looks delicious I like to tell people like being honest when i'm fasting i don't drink or eat for taste uh -huh. But it's a bonus when you get something that tastes really good. Right. This tastes really good. It tastes earthy. It tastes home. I don't know how to explain it. It tastes so leafy at the same time, you know? Right. It's, it's really true. like the perfect balance. It's the perfect balance of a fruit and vegetable drink. This works for me, the Ninja. But for people that's big on texture, I can still chew a little bit with, um, the ninja blend some people don't like to chew or taste like pulp and stuff like that in their food i mean in their drinks i want to go get a ninja or something like that because it can pure like finely you know what i'm saying grate it but i don't prefer that because um while i'm fasting i actually enjoy chewing as a whole you know what i mean so when it comes to me eating i just like to chew type shit. so it helps me being able to chew you know what I'm saying? Help wing off from eating food. Y'all, look. Y'all, we about to go ahead and weigh. All I'm gonna say is, I had hopped on the scale real quick just to see what was going on. I know I look like crazy and boo the fool. But bro, I am just, yeah, I'm about to hop on the scale real quick. Y'all can see what's going on, okay? This is day six, by the way, day six. Day six. <sighs> Yesterday I had some cucumbers, y'all and a bubble tea. Um, I always get the black milk tea. I like to do tea instead of coffee when I'm fasting. Um, I just feel like it's more effective. It's tea, it's really good, it's still whatever. Um, I'll do tea instead of um, coffee, you know? 
because I'm one of those people I need my little drink a day. So uh, outside of the smoothies, I might get a tea. Um, and that'll be like my my little, you know, snack or whatever. But look at my face and look at that neck. But let's hop straight. Let's hop on this scale, okay? Yo. Do y'all see what I'm saying? Do y'all see what I'm saying? Those days can vary, bruh. So yesterday on day five, I, um, yesterday on day five, I worked out. I went to the gym. Um, uh, day four, I had did a small workout. So, of course, that's going to super boost. But as you see, um, I lost almost two and some pounds in one day. But that's how it be. That's what I was kind of telling you. So if you have a day where <sighs> your weight don't go down, don't be like, don't feel no type of way about it. Just understand that it's a process. You know what I'm saying? And it doesn't mean that you're not doing the right things or your fasting is not going good. Um, yeah, just take it one day at a time, man. But like I said, fasting is for mental purposes. I do it for mental strategy. Um, it helps me focus on the stuff that I'm trying to get done and a lot of different stuff. So it's definitely used for more than just losing weight. Um, but even if you are targeting weight loss, just make sure you don't like completely depend upon, oh, every day I weigh myself, it should go lower, you know? But as y'all can see, y'all can look at my face in this video and see that I have came down. Like all the fat on my body is just disappearing. The actual fat is crazy, okay? It's really crazy. But y'all, we're about to get to my first smoothie today. Well, first, no, actually, I'm gonna drink a smoothie in a little bit. I'm gonna drink, go ahead and drink my bottle of water. Um, and yeah, make sure y'all stay hydrated throughout this whole process because I might give me a little workout in the day. I might give me a little workout in the day, y'all. Y'all, day seven, look at this. My abs are coming in. Look at the abs on day seven. Wow, seven days, bro. Just seven days. It's day seven. This shit is just getting easier each day. It's day seven, we about to weigh up. Y'all see that? My abs are poking through. This is not no joke. Stop taking my fast for a joke, it's not a joke. Bro, I done came down like crazy. Let's go, let's do the way up. So y'all, what's up? Um, It's me and my bestie, y'all. So, since it's day seven, as a celebration, we've decided to do a cheat meal. So I'm very excited, y'all. Um, he surprised me with this new location that I've never been to before. And I guess I'll show you guys what I'm eating. I'm still gonna try my best to eat as clean as possible. But um, absolutely, y'all. It's about to go down up in here, okay? Are y'all ready? So y'all went with the seafood and then a lot of green a little linguine we got salmon we have spinach we have sweet potato and yeah rice uh noodles some uh crab legs some oysters in the shell you want some of those you want some of that some shrimp so y'all, I had ate that stuff, and boy, when I she tell you, up, I had to go to the toilet, honey. <laughs> Smell like straight trash. Look, I'm not even playing no games for the rest of this fast, man. I might even extend to 30 days, I'm not gonna lie, because I just love the way my body feels. Um, but that's it for tonight, y'all. I will see y'all tomorrow on day eight. Like I said, I did take a cheat day today, um, and I paid for it on that toilet, okay? Period. So tomorrow I'm gonna holler at y'all and I'm gonna let y'all know if I plan to go a month or not. I'm thinking about potentially going a month in the fast with one cheat day a week. Comment down below what y'all Y'all, it's fast day eight and like I said, yesterday was my cheat day. Um, so I didn't come in here and do pretty much nothing, but I am about to hit this gym, so I'm gonna let y'all see a little bit of what's going on in this gym. Okay, but other than that, today we got back to the protocol. Y'all already know what's up. Smoothie in the morning, woo woo So yeah, we'll be weighing up again either tomorrow or the next day, and we are gonna keep it going, y'all. I'm still considering doing 30 days. Um, I haven't made a decision yet. If I do do 30 days, I'm gonna take one cheat day a week. And yeah, let's see, and I'll probably add in raw veggies into the fast if i do continue on for 30 days comment down below what y'all think i'm gonna do here it is y'all look at me look at me look at me
We got a court crazy in here, bestie. We back at it even stronger than before, okay? What's up, y'all? It's day 10 and I'm back in this thing. I know I've been gone a couple days, y'all. I had to recover. Man, if I can say something, y'all, I'm gonna tell you if you're fast, don't take cheat days. Because when you're fasting and your body get used to eating nothing but fruits, vegetables, shit like that, and you go and put that food in your body, y'all, I was kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie. It had like gave me nausea and stuff like that. Um, so especially like when you're winging off for your fast, or <laughs> if you're gonna take a cheat day, it needs to be something predominantly around greens, and then if it's gonna be a meat, it has to be super light. So my best friend, clearly y'all see, clearly y'all see that he hooked me up and took me to, Hold on, I'll be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, so my bad about that. Um, pretty much what I was saying is, um, when you take a cheat day, it is best to eat something light still. <laughs> Boy, my bestie, who is also my trainer, y'all, make sure y'all go follow him on Instagram at Just Watch Me Fitness. Um, he's also my trainer. He took me to a damn hibachi buffet for my cheat day. And um, I fast all the time, y'all, so, I kind of know how my body is when it comes to doing stuff like that. So I pretty much know how it is, how my body reacts because I do fast often. Um, and yeah, my body does not like meat. So <laughs> when I'm fasting right away, I have to wait a few days just to be able to eat meat again. Like I have to start with fish, salmon, um, something extremely light, okay, before I'm able to eat. Um, chicken and stuff like that again. So yeah, at the hibachi place, man, I felt nausea, I felt sick. Um, when I'm fasting, y'all, I can't eat any grease. Like literally coming off the fast, I'm not able to eat grease or none of that shit. So it took me some recovery days, y'all, but now everything is back on track and I have not eaten solid food since. And honey, I'm not until this fast is over with. But yeah, them cheat days, boy, get you. Them cheat days will jack you up, okay? So don't do it, just don't even do it. And I still don't feel a desire to eat food. I still don't feel a desire to like, you know, I still don't feel a desire. Um, So I feel great. My fast is still going good. Um, I'm back on track and things like that. Woo, y'all. Only if y'all knew. Day 10, had to detox all that stuff out that I had just ate. <laughs> so I feel like I'm back on track doing good. Now, we gonna continue this fast, y'all. Um, we gonna, we gonna roll with the punches and I just wanna keep, be as transparent with y'all as I can. People be fasting and this and this and that, they be lying, they be, man, my waist look ridiculous, baby. Look ridiculous. I never um was fasting to lose weight or anything like that so my goal is to just get healthy you feel me i want to be healthy i want to detox my body um and shit like that so that's my purposes but honey that waist then disappeared i'm gonna show y'all later i'm gonna take this waist trainer off when we get back to the house uh -huh. in a minute so what's up y'all it is day 11. look at this waist y'all it's day 11 we about to take this waist trainer off Together, guess I do sleeping miles. I don't be playing no game. If y'all want a trainer, y'all can get it from baefashion.com. This is an amazing waist trainer. Woo! 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 Shit, what's going on? Okay. Do y'all see that? Day 11. Y'all, swear to God. Abs flat, stomach flat. That make your booka booka book look fatter. Period. Period. <laughs> up. All right, y'all, so we about to weigh up real quick, man. We gonna continue our day, y'all, day 11. Okay, y'all, we 195.8. Woo! 
y'all. This transformation is crazy, okay? Like completely crazy. I like a whole different person. And the crazy thing about it is throughout this weight loss, I've been working out. And I know that I've also been transferring fat into muscle because I do build muscle fast because my body builds muscle fast. So when I say that, I mean like if you look at my body before the 11 days, right? Yes, I have lost a lot of weight, but I've also picked up a lot of muscle in that time. That's crazy. So yeah, y'all, we gonna get to this next, uh, we about to get to the smoothie. Oh, y'all got new nails too. Shout out to my nail tech, y'all. Um, new nails, they're not as long, but yeah, we're about to get this day started because it is shoe day for me. Baby girl about to get to shooting and all that today. What it is, y'all, is day 12. Okay, um, it's extra crazy, I have to say. Y'all, it's extra crazy as y'all know, um, I be doing my fitness training, um, my Buns and Body Boot Camp class. So, uh, day 12 is going to be my last day of the fast, and I'm going to start back eating food tonight um, due to the fact that I wanna have more than enough energy and things like that for tomorrow. I don't wanna feel burnt out. I don't wanna feel um, any type of fatigue. I don't wanna feel tired. Um, even though I don't feel that now, I know that when I go to this Buns and Body Bootcamp class and teach everybody, it's about to be crazy. I'm gonna push myself to the maximum because it's like I'm teaching other people and it's my class. I'm going to be in class going crazy. So. Um, I am going to eat um, tonight. Um, I do feel that afterwards, I'm still gonna keep up. Y'all, I'm probably gonna do a lot of raw fruits and veggies throughout the day. Um, and then maybe, you know, like a meal, a, a meal with meat, maybe once a day type of thing. But um, I still haven't decided yet, but I do know that tonight I'm gonna end my fast um, because I have been very strict on myself with this fast and I have received really good results outside of my one cheat day, <laughs> okay? We're gonna cap this thing off. And then I'm gonna sit down and give you guys later on a recap and things to do, not to do, or whatever um, throughout your fast. So yeah, y'all, I'm super excited. Um, I look amazing, my body looks amazing, I feel amazing, I'm definitely detoxed, and um, this fast was definitely worth it. So once again, I wanted to come just to show y'all my body without the trainer. One more time, y'all. So that's what I'm looking like from the side. Okay. My abs are coming in now. Yeah. So yeah, y'all see, baby girl came a long way from the beginning. So here you have it.